Hey, what's up guys? Andy here, and today we're reviewing over Black Clover, episode 96, titled The Black Bull's Captain vs. The Crimson Wild Rose. This was an insane episode. Uh, in the description box, I will be leaving a guest pass, if I've still got one, I think I do. Uh, for whoever gets it first, go ahead and watch this episode, because it was insane. I wish I could do more for you all, but that's the best I can do. Uh, but for now, let's talk about this uh, episode. A quick little recap of this episode is simply, holy shit. Uh, the elves are reborn. Uh, Charlotte is an elf. Um, Yami is fighting said elf. So many key players are elves. Noel and Kirish are in major fucking deep shit here. Uh, not counting everybody else's, and they're all got one thing on their mind, and that is fuck the humans. And I guess that assumes for you know as well, so... Uh, <laughs> I'm not sure uh, where this is all gonna go, but uh, we, we've got a lot of stuff to talk about, so let's get right into this review. And if y'all do enjoy it, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. It really helps me out a lot in the long run, and you get to see content like this every day of the week. So, win-win for both of us, but with that being said, let's go ahead and jump right into this review. They say you don't have so we start the episode off with a lot of recap, a good amount recapping everything up until this point. We get our intro and title card, the Black Bulls Captain versus the Crimson Wild Rose. That'll make perfect sense in just one moment, but then we cut over here to real interrogating uh, these Eye of the Midnight Sun guys, and then they start disintegrating. We see, like, their soul or power go into an orb, and then they just shoot up and start getting, like, separated around. And, uh, they go into these characters, and the elves are being reborn here. I'm gonna go over quickly everybody they got. As you can see here, they have Ghosh. We cut over through a bunch of different villages and villages and see, uh, like, the lights and stuff, and we got Marie, we got Ben and Luck, which Luck's a key player. We got Rill here, Klaus, Yuno, and Hammond, and Owen and Marks, which we got a lot more too, but don't get me wrong, but those are, like, the key players, I feel like. And we have Ghosh here and every one of them else saying just be gone humans and then attacking. Uh, we cut over to Owen and Marks attacking Yami here and Yami just freaking goes straight lightless blade storm and it cuts them down pretty simply. But even he says it himself like you know even these, neither one of these two specialize in battle magic at all. Like one erases memories and one is a doctor literally healing. But they were this much trouble, what is going on, you know? And he starts putting it together, and that's when Charlotte shows up. Charlotte was afflicted by the curse, as we know, which made her roses blue. We'll talk about that in a minute, but these are red roses. And she comes to the aid of Owen and Marks, which who are elves, so that's not them anymore. But she saves them pretty much, and then her and Yami have a badass fight. Like, you literally have to see it. Go watch it. I know some people don't use Crunchyroll or don't support, like, full-on releases, but I recommend it highly. But if you don't, okay, just watch this episode. Uh, we cut over to the flashback here and where he saved her, pretty much, from the thing. And she's just like, you know, I don't know you, human. And that's when it got really emotional because... Soul is a character that I've always enjoyed, but never really had a reason to get behind until now. She's like, I won't leave my sis. You know, when you attacked us back there, you didn't mean that, right? And, you know, Yami tells her the situation, and she's like, well, I'm going to bring him back myself. And he's like, no, take take the this orb and run somewhere safe, which she don't know it's the Wizard King. But that's when, you know, Yami and her go back to the fight, and they, they it is incredible. Uh, I love the animation in this episode, but on par with, like, just the, the dramatic emotion, it was insane, and that's when we cut into here, and this is where I said Noel and Kirish are in big trouble, because Ben and Luck are probably two of the most haphazard, randomest characters on the team, and they are positioned with them, and Luck is crazy enough, but with that power buff... I don't think Noel or Kirish can even stand a chance. I mean, 
it's going to be hard. And then plus you got Ben there providing assistance. So yeah, that's my review for Black Clover episode 96, gang. I hope y'all did enjoy it. I really want to get this up to you all, so I'm going to make this short, sweet, and simple. Overall, I loved this episode. It was insane. But with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and head out. I've got work today, guys. So if y'all did enjoy this video, like I said, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It really does mean a lot and help me out in the long run. And I cannot wait till next week to see where this is going to go. But with that being said, please no spoilers in the comments. That'd be great. And I'll catch y'all next time. Peace out.